Hey, what's up, man? Uh, sorry, I'm running late. The fucking uh, internet, so fucky on me again. So yeah, I apologize for that. How are you? What's up? Here in the chat. Easy. Nice the Kraken. Are we canceled? No, we're not canceled. Don't cancel on news like that. No. I would let you know ahead of time, some way. Even like my internet like goes out on me sometimes like that. Uh, hey Chester, how are you, man? All right, so might as well get this party started here. Planet Druidium. Underneath the air shield, 10,000 years of fresh air. We must get through that air shield. We will, sir. Once we kidnap the princess, we can force her father, King Roland, to give us the combination to the air shield, thereby destroying Planet Druidia and saving Planet Spaceball. Everybody got that? Spaceballs, the movie. Princess, that's the spaceship within range, sir. Good. Now we will show her who is in charge of this galaxy. If you do not with me, the combination to the air shield, Dr. Slotkin will give your daughter back her old nose. Only one man and his trusted companion can save planet Druidia from disaster. Okay, Eagle Five, coming in. Moon Star. First, they must learn the secrets of yoga. I am the keeper of a greater magic. The Force? No, the Schwartz. Avoid capture on a distant planet. Come up the cold the desert, you hear me? Cold the desert! Found any desert? We ain't found... Battle the entire Spaceball Army. and escape the clutches of Dark Helmet. I see your Schwartz is as big as mine. The bench can proceed to escape time. What the matter with this sea level? When does this happen in the movie? Give me more. Space Balls. The movie. The Schwartz be with you. <laughs> Fucking Bell Brooks. Love this film. I saw it five times. This. Oh, really? Jeez. Must have been fucking <laughs> right now. Internet is so hard to handle. You know, sometimes, especially with the company I deal with, uh, Eastlink, they fucking suck, man. They used to be good. And then it's like this new uh, system they got, it, it's a lot worse than it ever was.
yeah, my hair shot my hair. My... That's fucking hilarious. Hey, Chrissy. How are you, man? Hey, Texas. <clears throat> So we got nine people in the chat. <clears throat> All right, I'm ready to watch the movie now, start here. I'm just gonna get it set up quick here. Yo, P. Rich, <laughs> yo. Oh yeah, I watched uh, your stream. Um, after uh, the fact, uh, last night, uh, text, uh, your stream with Juno and uh, Sean, man, that's fucked up how some people take like the streaming thing way too fucking serious. Like, wow, Jesus, man, I think I'm gonna subscribe to that. I don't know, man. like. I don't support people like that. Like, that's ridiculous. Like, tech Sean, like, just because you were going live at the same time, and like, wow, yeah, man, that's pretty fucked up, I think. Just looking on the uh, earlier. Oh, just hold on. I have nothing to do with that. Yeah, I know. It was Sean. Yeah. Sean and that other fella. <laughs> I got a big Joe like rant on tomorrow on a certain film. Oh, nice. Right on, man. I can't wait to see it, Chris. What movie is it that you're going to do a rant on? Hey, what's up? Oh. Hey, what's up, Megan? <coughs> Good to see you, bro. I'm glad you can make it. That's awesome. And Ashton's here. Hey, Ashton. How are you, man? All right, I'll we'll count down from 10. So, 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Press play. <laughs> Dick Warlock was the pinch guard. Uncredited also was the stunt coordinator for this movie. He is great stuntman. Dick Warlock, he is a great stuntman. I didn't know that, Chester. Wow. Huh. Yeah, he is a great stuntman. Like that fire walk he does in uh, Halloween 2. Like, holy fuck, man. Like, he was golfed and fucking flames. I'd say that's probably like one of the best firewalks I've ever seen in a movie, like to be honest. <clears throat> Russell says, love that John Hurt scene when he does a 
parody of his alien chest person scene. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, not again. <laughs> yeah, it's fucking awesome. I love it too. It's like, hello, my lady. Hello. <laughs> That's seen a frog from like the fucking Bugs Bunny uh, cartoon. Oh shit. No, no. You know, in your stomach and forget to wash it off before you fall asleep. I knew it. I'm surrounded by assholes. <laughs> it's funny in this movie, like all the uh, merchandise and they do like consumerism, like all the merchandise and for space balls because like Star Wars was like doing like everything like for merchandise. Yeah, that's the scene where it says. <laughs> you meant to say Balkan. Oh, yeah, okay. Now I got you. Dick Warlock is in society. Is he? That's, that's quite the movie. That's a fucked up movie. The ending of that film is, yeah, really messed up. It's a good one. I like it. Dick Warlock has got to be the coolest, most badass name ever. I know, right? Dick Warlock. <laughs> it's pretty badass. I agree with you. Yeah, thanks, Chester. Don't forget to hit that like button. The power of Christ compels you to hit that like. <laughs> That's a new one. Uh, it's funny. <laughs> Dark helmet. <laughs> I can't breathe in this thing. Rick, Mo <laughs> Rick Moranis. He's pretty fucking funny. <laughs> Especially in this movie. He's fucking hilarious in this movie. <laughs> Like, oh shit. No, no, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's like basically like kicking some of the nuts. <laughs> Rick more anus. <laughs> Oh, that's awesome, Rosalie. Yes. Oh, that's good. That's awesome. I'm going to use that now. Rick Mori. <laughs> I'm a mug, half man, half dog. <laughs> I'm a mug. And barf. <laughs> 
And they all like hold their fucking crotch. Uh, Mr. Radar, Mr. Coffee. Funny how he talks like directly to the fucking camera is uh, <laughs> so like uh, self aware. This movie, I love it. It's too funny. The Mackenzie brothers. <laughs> yeah. That's funny. Uh, that's my mother's uh, maiden name, Mackenzie. Go for it. Yeah, I will. I definitely will. Mel Brooks played a role and directed it as well. I'm pretty sure he does that in, in most of his movies, does he? Oh shit, there was a tornado. Oh damn. And Prince Valium, aka Monroe, in Too Close for Comfort. <laughs> That's funny. Oh shit. Why did you get one, Mega? Funny. Every time she's like, Daddy, I'm wrong. And then it's like they stop and like, they're all pissed off. And, then, <laughs> and the guy she's marrying looks like such a fucking idiot. This guy's like straight up Pope. <laughs> Runs right past the altar and run into the room. Oh, fuck, that's funny. Oh, it's heading for you now? Oh, damn, man. Shit. Fuck, oh, man. That's kind of scary, man. Oh, shit. Try to stay safe. See, man. You're on alert till 10. <laughs> yeah, hopefully you guys don't like get like get tired or anything. Better not be like, like real fucking bad. Tornado Alley, baby, I'm right in it. <laughs> Magazine. <laughs> The first rock in the in the, the house of you.
He always hits them all the time with his tail right there. It's funny. <coughs> Rich, uh, do one of Mel Brooks' silent movies with Mel, Marty Feldman, and Dom DeLucy. Only one word spoken expert for oh, some great stars of mass. Okay, I'll have to keep that in mind. Just remind me sometime, Russell. Pizza the Hut. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. Look how it's like Pizza the Hut's like throbbing and all the shit's like falling down off of them. <laughs> or else pizza is going to send it for you. Tornadoes are very common in the South. I've had many close calls. You had the South guess some lot. Yeah. Here in Michigan, we don't ever have tornadoes, just thunderstorms and nice weather. We got a lot like Canada, hey Chester. Hey Ryan, how are you? When John Candy said that's going to leave a mark, <laughs> what was it? <laughs> oh shit. Baseball city. It's like just air. It's like a can of air. <laughs> it's an air. <laughs> Captain Screw. Yeah. He plays like two different roles in this uh, Mel Brooks. Scotty beat me twice last night. It's funny when they beat him up. He's like backwards. Hey, Brock, how are you? Good to see you. Why does someone tell me my ass is so big? <laughs> it's heading your way, too, is it? Damn. We had one in Northern Ontario years ago. What side of 
one side of the was bad and dot the hat over to the other side. Well, Alberta gets them a lot, I find. Like, not like a lot, but they do get them sometimes. Like out west, Alberta and Saskatchewan. A ball, oh, Charlie. Spaceship looks like a giant cock. <laughs> yeah, you're supposed to get them. Oh, damn. Hope you stay safe. Like, hope you don't get hit hard. I watched the video you posted about coming up in May. Yeah, um, yeah, those are. Uh, some of the watch logs go off. Yeah, Pizza Hut wants to set out for you. <laughs> His eyes are crossed. He's cross -eyed. He's like, sorry, I'm doing my best. And the other guy's eyes are crossed. A major asshole. His name is. <laughs> I know that. What's his name? Major asshole. He's like, I'm surrounded by a bunch of assholes. <laughs> Keep firing, assholes. <laughs> I love that. Great video you did for May Peerage. That was Dope Song too, right? Yeah, by Dope. Yeah. Die, motherfucker. Die. That's what it's called. Die, motherfucker, die. Yo, aliens. Stay tuned for Rocky 5000. Or a billion space box. <laughs> Have you guys seen uh, Robin Hood Bed in Tights? <laughs> That's another good uh, Mel Brooks movie. It's pretty fucking funny. <laughs> Yeah, space balls to play for all our kids just love them. <laughs> for money or a shitload of money. <laughs> We're not just doing it for money. We're doing it for a shitload of money. That's fun. Radar is about to be jammed. <laughs> Just plain yogurt. 
<laughs> right? It's fucking hilarious. This guy was in this uh, police academy movies, this uh, black guy making all the sound effects. <laughs> The bleeps. <laughs> Sweeps. <laughs> the creeps. It appears to be Jeff. Raspberry. <laughs> Logan Sky. Smoke if you got him. <laughs> It's still my finger. It's been inside the dark side. I'm a bog. Two sides to every sports. I got the downside. <laughs> Oh, thanks, Tex. Thanks, man. Appreciate it. It's like all our luggage. <laughs> The size of like that fucking shaver. What the fuck is that? <laughs> she said, I want this fucking place all clean though. <laughs> She's like giving him orders. It's his best buy. Best buy. Yeah. Thanks, Russell. Thanks. <clears throat> Funny. She doesn't look Jewish. <laughs> oh, shit.
We call it the hyperactive. <laughs> it's fucking hilarious. He's like, we're going into ludicrous speed. <laughs> What's wrong, Colonel Sanders? Chickens. <laughs> yeah, that's uh, my son. Uh, he's crying in the background. Yeah, he doesn't want to go to bed. <laughs> Uncle went slow. As a kid, yeah. Ridiculous speed. <laughs> Ludicrous speed. The God of Plaid. Good that you were wearing that helmet. It's flat hat now. Smoke him if you got him. Oh man, he sounds really upset. He yeah, has autism, so it's like, yeah. His emotions get like even more intense. What's the matter, girl? Chicken? <laughs> yeah, a little bit. Is he okay? Uh, Z so was in here not long ago. I think he might still be here. Oh, yeah, I think he's okay. Seems like he was okay.
Yeah, he said it was coming his way. Yeah. Thought he was like getting ready for it. <laughs> you are a royal paid in the ooh. <laughs> our, our favorite scene is the chest burst in with the scene in the dance and alien scene. Yeah, I love that too. Yeah. Like all the luggage they have to carry. <laughs> She's only got an umbrella. <laughs> the rest of them have to carry all that heavy shit. <laughs> I hope she didn't forget anything. <laughs> Look at the size of the hair drying. Jesus, hard hair. I can't live without it. <laughs> hey, what's up? Woo, woo, woo. Hey, Derek. How are you, man? I wrote back. Did you hear I do Transformers is coming out? Transformers, well, they are doing a reboot, but this is animation. It looks really good. Yeah, I heard something about that, but uh, I didn't know it was animation. Cool, man. Yeah. I'll have to see, like, uh, what you mean? Yeah. We'll get to that. They're like hitting around. Disney is hitting around, making another Indiana Jones film, Indiana Jones Six, and it's like, oh, are you fucking kidding me? Like, just give it up already. <laughs> like, they'll probably just get like a hair support to be like AI. I bet you, he's he's fucking too old to be playing Indiana Jones. I think. Oh, the trailer is out. Okay. Yeah, I'll have to watch it. Yeah. Trailer looks good. All right. Uh, yeah, I'll watch it. Is the hurricane coming your way too, Derek? Because my parents are getting ready to leave uh, tomorrow, I do believe. <clears throat> Here it is, sir. Spaceballs, the movie. <laughs> I love this scene. <laughs> the part where they go with ludicrous speed, and he's like, oh, just fast forward through this. <laughs> this fact. This never happened. <laughs> In fact, never play this again. <laughs> Your cat came back tonight. The kids were happy. She was missing for three days. Oh, damn. Needles. Uh, needless to say, she has eaten two gall cans of tuna. Oh, shit. Must have been hungry, yeah. Three days. Probably eating like birds and shit like that. Wow. That's good that it came back, though. 
Yeah, the kids must have been happy. They were probably upset, were they? I still wonder why Blumhouse can't do other movie from a franchise that is not horror. I don't know, it beats me because nobody can come up with anything fucking original anymore. I think it's because if they pick a franchise that was successful, that that's like their golden ticket right there. Like they're guaranteed to make shitloads of money. I think that's why they do it. But they don't do it in a good way. They just fucking hire fucking idiots that can't write anything. Fucking like, I don't know, inventive or anything. Uh, Blumhouse sucks. That's all I can say. Yours was gone for a week, but came back. <laughs> uh, maybe probably just try to look for some other uh, tale. They're like, oh, go, going back to hating each other now. <laughs> That's how they flirt. <laughs> I hope he doesn't get Friday 13th or Elm Street. Yeah, I hope not either. I hope not. He could have Blair Witch. That's fine. <laughs> Top web, no one will save you slower, slaughter house, etc. Oh. Yeah, I say cobweb. I mean, I try to get through this. I thought it was okay, yeah. Only two other animals that walk like cats is the camel and giraffe. Oh, cool. The Wizard of Oz parody scene, yeah, <laughs> right? On oh, my other channel, oh. I'm going to do at some point, like, it's a, at some point, yeah, where I get around doing more of that content on my second channel. Um, I'm going to do a deep dive on Wizard of Oz. Oil, oil, <laughs> room service. Of course, she would say that. <laughs> Did you ever get a chance to watch Samurai yet, Grizzle? Of on episode nine, it keeps getting better. No, I have it. Yeah, I'll have to give that a watch. It's called Samurai. All right, cool.
Thanks for the recommendation there. Joan Rivers' voice is great. <laughs> How about you guys? We ain't seen shit. <laughs> it's on Hulu. It's a remake from early 1980s series. Okay. Yeah, I'll give it a watch. Have you seen the 1980 series before, Derek? <clears throat> One of these uh, midgets or small people um, is, uh, what's his name? Uh, was it Tony Cox or whatever, the guy who plays in Bad Santa <laughs> as the elf? Like, Billy Bob Thornton's sidekick thing. No, I read some reviews. <clears throat> Someone bought it to my attention on Big Tech's stream last evening. Okay. <laughs> Look at the size of Candy's foot. <laughs> What would you say John Candy's best role was? Just imagine if John Candy did pass away all of the movies that could have been. He was one of my faves. Mine too. I love John Candy. Oh man, he was great. The last film he did wasn't that great though. The, the one of, like, uh, there were like a, uh, in the Western, the Western movie he made, I forget what it's called, but uh, I remember I, I didn't like it that much. Yeah, same with Chris Farley. Like, imagine if Chris Farley never died. Yeah, it's too bad John Candy passed away. He was great. Wagons East. But you're right, yeah. Yeah, I wasn't the biggest fan of that one. I like uh, Uncle Buck. That was a great one. Great Outdoors. That's another good one. Uh, yeah, Great Outdoors. I get a kick out of that one. Uh, yeah, fuck you. He's been in some good ones. Planes, trains, and automobiles. I love that one. Bro, I was gonna, I was going to Chris Farley also. Bro, I was, oh, you were going to say, yeah, Chris Farley, yeah, he was great too. Like imagine like the films he would have been in also. 
Yeah, all the merchandise and the shop. The captain screw with these two girls that space ball like uh, blankets. <laughs> As a kid, I used to have Empire Strikes Back, like a bed uh, set. Loved the uh, loved the great outdoors. Brooke says, "Yeah, that was great." Plays trades and automobiles. One of his best performances, I think so. As Dal Griffith. <laughs> yeah. The shower curtain rain. <laughs> oh man, it's too fucking funny. <laughs> In uh, Calgary, you could buy a, a John Candy stick, uh, like the one he eats in uh, The Great Outdoors. If you could eat all that steak, you could get it for free. That's pretty badass. I want to try it. I never have, but next time I go back um, to Calgary, I'm going to order that steak if they still got it. Armed and dangerous. <laughs> Chester says, I like the great outdoors, Uncle Buck, and plays trades and automobiles. Yeah, those are my favorite ones. Never under underestimate the power of the Schwartz. I like going berserk. Also him and yeah, Eugene Levy were great together. Yeah, Luigi or Eugene Levy. He is great. I like him. Yeah, berserk was funny. Yeah. I don't, the bear getting a shot on his butt at the great outdoors is hilarious. Yeah, that's my favorite scene in the movie with the bear comes. Yeah, even sort of with uh, John Candy's uh, like uh, skits, uh, SNL skits were funny, pretty funny shit. Stripes, yeah, with Bill Murray, that was a great one. Both of his kids look exactly like him. Oh, do they? Shit. I never do that. He was, yeah, he played the security guard at Wally World. <laughs> it was fucking hilarious. I love that scene with uh, Chevy Chase. He holds up a gun to him <laughs> because they're closed. Wally World's closed. Oh, I love that movie. That's a great movie, too. Vacation.
a red equation that is fucking hilarious. Hard to believe he was 43 when he passed. Oh, was he? It's pretty young. Canadian bacon, yeah. That was a funny one too. Canadian beer sucks and a fight breaks out at the hockey game. I would say that movie in years. Canadian bacon. <laughs> Space balls to the search of more body. <laughs> He's right about that. I used to drink past Blue Ribbon. When I lived in upstate New York, we had a fire pit and we would put our beets in the snow, or your beers in the snow to keep the frosty. Yeah. Yeah, it keeps them nice and cold. It's what we used to do to a party or in the winter time. Instead of the fr fridge, we would just put them in the snow. <laughs> used to get some fire coke up there. <laughs> uh, damn. Uh, He's playing with the toy figures. He's like, oh, your helmet. Oh, ooh, ooh, ooh. <laughs> he, he walks in, he's like, Plop. <laughs> Did you see anything? No, sir, I didn't see you playing with your dolls again. <laughs> I'm good. <laughs> Space balls, the toilet paper. <laughs> Oh man, too funny. I lost my uncle Tom in 94, same year when Caddy died. Oh, sorry to hear that, man. That's hard to believe. 94 is where he died. <laughs> she looks deaf while he's pissing. <laughs> She's like, <laughs> that's funny. Is Harold Ramis as the doctor, the nose jaw doctor? She already had a nose job for a sweet 16. <laughs> He's going to put back her old nose. And... That's an ugly ass nose. Enter the same month, two but different days. Oh man, 
That's rough. Sorry to hear that. I used to drink whole 45. Yeah, same here. The 40 ounce bottles. Yeah. When I lived in Calgary, oh, as a teenager, like I moved back and forth from here to Calgary because uh, my dad uh, lived out there too. And as much as I didn't get along with my dad and all that shit, but uh, I. Uh, I uh, used my brother's ID <laughs> to buy like alcohol. <laughs> I would always buy like a Colt 45. It was 46. Damn, that's young. Sorry to hear that. Been sober since January. Congratulations, man. That's great, man. Keep it up. Yeah, that's horrible. Man. I was so sorry to hear that, Russell, that you had to go through that. Yeah, you idiots, you captured your stunt doubles. <laughs> or it's more like, you idiots, you captured their poor doubles. For illegal parking. Yeah. You're under arrest. For illegal part. <laughs> like the size of the key, <laughs> you know, all he had to do was press the button. <laughs> oh, it's hilarious, man. My grandmother passed away the week after my birthday. Oh, damn. Shit. Sorry to hear that, man. Last year, she passed away January 18th. My birthday was on the 12th. Ah, oh, it's rough. We were 13 and 14 when we had it at 69. Yeah. Oh, man. She's amazing. <laughs> Her voice. <laughs> and those are the guys who stole our uniforms and they beat the shit out of us too <laughs> Way now, um, very like strange how he died, but this was his favorite movie. Yeah. We would watch it all the time and always reference it. Uh, 
A year later, your dad died of lung cancer and was only 54 and I was 22. Oh, that's rough, man. That's still young, too, 54. They had bone cancer. That would be rough. <laughs> it's like the princess, like they're stuck doubles. It's like they just got a mustache. Was that? <laughs> He's like, not bad for a girl. <laughs> hey, old screw. I found a copy of, uh, for a naked gun, so I can reschedule that at some point too. Cause I, yeah, I wanted to do a watch along to that movie. What's that coming out of her nose? That's <laughs> baseball shit. There goes the neighborhood planet of the apes. <laughs> what do you think of the new planet of the apes, Bill? They're not that bad. It's like the spaceship's like morphing into like one giant ass fucking <laughs> vacuum cleaner. Are you going to reschedule sleep away camp free? See, uh, I was thinking about maybe I'll just do it on my own. Uh, I'm not sure. Uh, I'll have to try to talk to Jet from uh, Villages Fix it again and see if she's able to. Uh, seems like uh, she's pretty busy at dealing with stuff. So I don't know. I'll ask her and see if she's able to. Uh, yeah. But I definitely would reschedule that with her again. Hey, what's up, Shaw? Yeah, I was saying to Texas earlier that when I watched uh, your guys' stream last night, and I can't believe that guy fucking messaged you saying that. Like, holy fuck, man. Like, taking that shit way too serious. Like, out of hand. Like, wow. Yeah, that's pretty fucked up. I think I might, like, unsubscribe to that. Like, that's unnecessary, man. <laughs> I have a Planet of the Apes box set. Nice. I like those movies. They're pretty good. You know, there's people out there who like this movie and never see Star Wars. How the fuck do they get 
what's going on. I know it, it's a parody, right? Well, they do parody other parody like other movies as well. But yeah, still, <clears throat> uh, yeah, you you need to watch Star Wars <clears throat> to watch this movie to like get the jokes, you know. <laughs> That's fucking weird. That, that'd be like the same as watching like scary movie one and two and never seen horror movies before. Like, you know what I mean? Like the jokes would just go right over your head. Like you, you would get them. Your uh, birthday stream tomorrow, Sean? She went from suck to blow. <laughs> Do something. Went from suck to blow. Yes, tomorrow. Okay, right on. <clears throat> I saw Star Wars before this. Well, yeah. <laughs> this came out in 87. And Star Wars was like, what, 74? 75? <clears throat> What's the next movie you got lined up for the channel, P? Uh, shit. I should know this. Just hold a sec. I'm just going to check quick. Oh yeah, the next one's uh, Up in Smoke and uh, Hansel and Gretel get baked on the 20th. Uh, I'm just thinking if I really want to do those. But other than the 20th, I, uh, uh, the cloud um, on the 22nd. That uh, baby uh, cop on the 24th, that the babysitter, and then after the babysitter, I got uh, gremlins on the 28th, and the babysitters on the 26th. So, yeah. I'm not sure if I, I don't know. Oh, father, with the up and smoke and Hansel Gretel get baked. Oh. Baby Act Cop is great. Her two is better, though. Yeah, the second one is great, also. I really enjoy the second one. Four twenty covered at no weed. Russell says yes, two is better. Psycho cop two is better. Yeah. <clears throat> I would have to agree. Yeah. <laughs> 
just trying to give it like the Balkan uh, grip or whatever. And he's like, what the hell are you doing? <laughs> and he tells them how to do it. Uh, fuck. The Belka pitch grip or whatever the fuck it is. Yeah, that bitch boy Keith that I've been dealing with this bullshit for more than seven months and I'm getting lit or light you know, after my streams tomorrow night. Yeah, man, that's that's pretty messed up. <laughs> we do this <laughs> spray the shaving cream in his eyes and his mouth. <laughs> Scattered, darkly animated film with Keanu Reeves. Oh, I've never seen that. Scattered, darkly? Cool. Is that newer, Russell? Motherfucker goes and makes a post that's direct towards me but can't say shit to my face. And he's jealous that my channel does better than his. Yeah, that's fucked. <laughs> I love this lightsaber battle. I see your Schwartz as big as mine. <laughs> oh. How will you handle it? Oh, fuck, man. <laughs> like hit the sound director. Oh man, it's fun. Gorfo, he thinks he can just talk to anyone with any way he wants to it. He needs to get punched in the mouth and eats the weight of call. So people do need a punch of the throat. <laughs> Maniac Cop 1 and 2 is better than the third one. I've never seen the third one, but I'll take your word for it. Yeah, like a force field around him. Lifts up his helmet to laugh at him and it fucking punches him in the face. <laughs> He's just holding him back. He's <laughs> That's hilarious. Oh, man. <laughs> yeah, I can't believe you fell for them. <laughs> here, here, let me give it back to you. <laughs> he draws her down the curtain. Oh, I can't believe you fell for that.
Hey, Corey. How are you, Beth? <laughs> he comes to shoot the dick with it and he bounces it back with the beer. Oh man, that's too funny. Where the hell are we, Paris? <laughs> this alarm's going on. Sounds like the fuck, like the police alarms. The sirens of the police. Cars and pigs. No, he just is. Yeah, it's, it sounds like it. <clears throat> yeah, to be honest, I don't think I will support someone like that. <laughs> Pizza to go. <laughs> Escape pods. Everyone's taking a look. channel but he never supports anyone and wonders why no one comes to his channel. I've never seen anyone have such a miserable time on YouTube and he loves that shit. Some people just do man. I don't know. Fuck that guy. That's all I can say. Fuck that guy. Yeah, exactly. Fuck that guy. Let's have fun. Exactly. It's just for fun, man. I don't know. Like, anyways, yeah. It's like self-destruct, and then it's like, have a good day. And they're like, thank you. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Russell. That's why we're here for fun. I do this shit for fun. I do it as a hobby. I don't take this shit serious, man. Like, come on, have you seen me? <laughs> I fucking, I, I, I don't take life too serious whatsoever. I don't. Like, to get mad over someone because you're doing a live stream at the same time they're doing what? It's like, that's going to happen, man. It's so fucking what? <laughs> like, I, I know uh, sometimes, like, uh, Sean and my schedules sometimes are, like, the same as well. But Sean has never, like, oh, you're stealing my time slot. <laughs> Like, fuck you. Like, you better not steal my time slot. Like, whatever. 
who the fuck do you think you are? <laughs> like shit happens. It's like he's not doing it on purpose either. It's like I know some nights I can't do live streams. Like some some days are better to do it during the day, and then even some days during the day is not good for me. And then right now, like some nights are better to do it because uh, like I could get uh, my daughter to bed pretty early now, like where before she was sick and and uh, yeah, where she should be up all night basically. And that's why I was having trouble like doing live streams during night a lot of the time because of that. But yeah, I mean, even like days, some like time during the day is kind of hard for me to do them as well. So I just do them whenever I can. And I definitely do not take this shit serious. Like I do it as a hobby, like something fun to do. I love uh, all you guys, man. I got a kick out of you guys, like Rosalia and Sean and like uh, Zodiac and Russell. And, um, Derek, like Moon Riders, like all you guys are awesome, man. You're Texas, he's great, he's fun. Like, you know what I mean? Like, uh, I see value, my friends. That's the difference between as you know. So, this my hobby to do this for fun and rants on a certain film that never should have been made. Yeah, like, I agree with Chris. Basically, yeah. That's why I do it. I love movies, and I like talking about movies, and I don't have anybody else to talk movies with. Like, when I do talk with my brother, like, me and him, we'll, like, have a conversation about other shit, too, that's going on around the world. Um, yeah, this is the scene here where they do the alien uh, parody. It's like, oh shit, not again. <laughs> What's wrong with this guy? Get a water my ass. Get a Pepto Bismol. <laughs> That's what I ordered. I ordered the soup. <laughs> Fucking alien pops out. Oh, no, not again. I love it. And then he breaks it in a song. <laughs> Hello, my friend. <laughs> Uh, so funny shit. Don't have believed friends on the street, but you guys. Yeah, I hear what you mean. You too, please, got me. <laughs> yeah. YouTube police got me so fucking crazy that all of this happens. Some people just welcome that misery and that gorephobe. Let's just have fun and have a great time. Exactly, Chester. Hey, Tex, you're back. At this point, he totally disrespected me, which is why I'm saying the shit I'm saying now. I ain't just going to sit there and take it. No, you shouldn't. You should be called out for it. And if it was the other way around, then I would step up for friends and say something to him. But this is when you know your friends are. That is true. Yeah, absolutely. I don't do videos and live streams, just be it in the chat rooms. And that's great, Chester, man. Uh, just you supporting uh, the content creators is 
It's awesome, man. You're a great guy, Chester. I always appreciated you, man. And I said for a couple of years now, like, because I, I met you at uh, Dave's chat, and I was always like, why why is a Chester like a mod? Like, he should be. Like, yeah, you're a great guy, Chester. I understand not wanting to get involved, but if you ain't there for your friends, then who the fuck are you at all? Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. That's how I look at it as. Do we need to start a queefing again? <laughs> any time, any place. <laughs> That's funny. I hope that that happens, Brooke. <laughs> Let's just have fun on your birthday stream. Exactly. And then Chris starts it off. I <laughs> queef the last Jedi. <laughs> Space queefs. <laughs> Rosie said yesterday. Space queens. <laughs> yeah, he's getting lit up toward the street. It's my birthday and I'll do it. I want to. <laughs> that'll be that'll be interesting. <laughs> You're an imposter from the jungles of Africa. <laughs> and the planet of the apes <laughs> in the sea. No shit. <laughs> this is a uh, statue of Liberty's head. <laughs> Just like in the planet of the apes movie. Oh, that's awesome. Yeah, this Pope guy is fucking weird and creepy. This the Pope shit is hat. Get lit for your birthday shot. Romance at the queef. <laughs> the queef believer. Dave have too many moderators, but being a moderator here on your fun hanging out with you guys. I don't think he has over a lot of moderators, but anyways, it's so all good. Not my channel. It's not my business. Yeah, happy birthday, Sean. Yeah, it'll be it'll be fun live stream for sure, man. How old are you turning 50? <laughs> I'm just like, you're gonna be 40 or 41? Biscuits and queef. <laughs> I don't give a shit who it is. I married someone today. Two queefs for Sister Sarah. How about wait at 50? You're 41. Okay. Yeah, I thought 41. Yeah. 40, 41, I thought. Next year, the big 60 for you. Damn, you don't look that old. Well, 60 is not even old, anyways, really. Age is just a number, basically. Silent queef, deadly queef. Yeah, that's, that's what I said last time. <laughs> I love that. 
Silent Night, Danny Queen. Uh, Rosalia left the chat. Yeah, she probably had something going on. She says, uh, Rick Moore ass. <laughs> Rick Moore, it is. <laughs> Rick Moore at, or sorry, Rick Moore anus. <laughs> Close to carriers of the Queen Kong. <laughs> oh, it's all good. I bitch and complain all the time. These damn tweeters. <laughs> Quefatic cough. Like soda maniac cough. Quefatic cough. 68th this August. Oh wow. Yeah, my stepdad, he's like 73. So he's up there. This is the story of two queefs. <laughs> A queef bear. <laughs> well, yeah, that's space balls. <laughs> Look who's queefing now. <laughs> the dick bag queef show. <laughs> That's awesome. Howard the queef. <laughs> yeah, I'll get some queefs in here before I uh, sign off. <laughs> Before I wrap it up. <laughs> what flew over the queef vest? <laughs> That's fucking good. One. The three queefers, the, the three queefeteers. So the three stooges, yeah, you say the three queefers, but it, the three uh, queefeteers. <laughs> Children should play with dead queefs. <laughs> and, he, and the queefers. Cheapers, queefers. Oh. oh man, that one's fucking hilarious. Cheapers, queefers. That's a fucking good one. <laughs> Don't torture a queef. <laughs> Queefs of <are> fire. <laughs> That's another good one. Oh, man. Definitely not good. For your badge, definitely needs a badge itself <laughs> from that one badge for so me queefs. Yeah. <laughs> Deep queef. Queefs of fire. <laughs> Definitely need so bad yourself for that. Oh man, that's funny shit. It's 
So yeah, April 20th would be the next watch a while. Cheech and Chad up in smoke and uh, Hansel and Gretel get baked. The little shop of queefs. <laughs> Big queef and little China. <laughs> Queef connection, uh, kiss the queefs. <laughs> oh shit, these are all good. Oh man, to live and die in a queef. <laughs> so to live and die in LA. <laughs> queefs of <on> Mars. <laughs> good queefs. <laughs> It's so sort of good, fellas. Good queefs. Uh, don't be a queef to society while queefing in the hood. <laughs> um, and a die queef with the vengeance. <laughs> private queef, private parts with Howard Stern. <laughs> private queef. Don't be a queef to society while queefing in the hood. <laughs> um, it makes some good poor movies to all these. Oh, man. Various queefs day off. Nice. Thanks for the stream. P. Chester says, yeah, no problem, guys. Like I said, yeah, I definitely don't take this shit seriously. I love hanging out with you guys. Queefs from outer space. <laughs> the queef yard. Oh. They queef live. Yeah, no problem. Like I said, yeah. I love hanging out with you guys and like watching a movie. It's like get to hang out with you guys and watch like the movies we all like, you know. It's awesome. Day of the queef. <laughs> White on the queef. <laughs> the incredible queef image. <laughs> it was hilarious that uh, self Park uh, fucking skit with Bertha Stewart. <laughs> the fucking queefs. <laughs> you want to decorate your queefs. <laughs> And stick them up there <laughs> like a Betty. <laughs> She's like, oh, what a special day. <laughs> I have a queef. Oh, man. <laughs> American queef in London. <laughs> oh, shit. Helps by the queef. Yeah. In the mouth of queefness. <laughs> oh shit. Yeah, you're going down on it, and then it's like queef right in your mouth. <laughs> in the mouth of queefness. Oh. Raging queef. <laughs> oh shit. Oh man. Fucking good times. Oh shit. I was at the edge of the queef. <laughs> Werewolves of the SS Nazi queefs. <laughs> That'd be awesome if they actually did make a movie to that. 
Oh man, I always wanted to see that. Like the Gride House uh, filled planetary and death proof, like with those trailers. And uh, I was always wanted uh, Thanksgiving too. And, uh, and we got that one. That'd be fucking sick if Rob Zombie's like, you know what? Now it's my turn to make werewolves of the SS Nazi. <laughs> Werewolves. Oh man, that'd be awesome. I know what you did last week. <laughs> Alpha did the queef bugs. <laughs> queef in places. <laughs> oh, that's a great one. Oh uh, shit, queef in places. Damn, Sean, you, you a savage. <laughs> yeah, all right, so. I guess I'll wrap it up for tonight, guys. <laughs> Get all the queefs out of you <laughs> before we go. I'm just looking at the titties in big collection. And going for the locker titties, tittles. Oh, you're going through, yeah, oh, titles. I thought that said titties for a sec. Sorry. I'm just looking at your titles. Yeah, and then you're going off the. Yeah, that's awesome. Godzilla versus Queef. Oh, no. All right, take care. Of it. Be safe, everyone. Yeah, you too, Sean. And happy birthday again. And can't wait uh, to uh, celebrate your birthday with you on your live stream tomorrow night. We fuck savage. <laughs> titties. Yeah, I, I read it wrong. I thought I said titties. My bad. <laughs> yeah, good night, Brooke. Good night, Chester. Good night, Texas. All right, yeah. If you guys are going over to Sean's channel tomorrow, that's where I'll be and we can all celebrate it together with uh, Sean. All right, good night, everybody. Have a good night. Love you. Bye. Oh, just hold on a sec. Yeah, I'll email you the link, P, if you can make it great and if not certainly won't hold out my youtube police badge <laughs> you better not man you better fucking not because <laughs> i'll fucking unsubscribe <laughs> i'm just fucking with it yeah i know what you mean yeah that's that's crazy shit but yeah um yeah i'll see you um, what tomorrow night's like and uh yeah just send me the link and if i could jump um on the panel with you i can yeah but please don't pull out your badge and fucking find me for not coming on <laughs> <laughs> oh man so funny shit yeah good night russell i created watch alongs <laughs> Oops, <laughs> you let that one slip. <laughs> he is the fucking stream master, all right? He's the god of all streams. <laughs> Holy shit. All right, take care, everybody. Good night. Uh, I'll see you tomorrow on Sean's channel. Okay, bye.